Well, yesterday was my son's anniversary. I sent them flowers. Don't know if they got them. And if they're still alive, I never know. Maybe they're trying to avoid me like I avoid my mom. I hate to think that because I tried to live differently. But uh, I'm kind of bummed out. So I'm going to attempt to go down and see AppFab, the movie. feeling kind of low missing my kids they had an anniversary Monday and you know you think about people and you miss them and but I'm really feeling low I was going to see Ab Fab the movie on Wednesday which is tomorrow and I thought what the hell let's go today so I did I went to Plaza Frontenac which is a very expensive hoity-toity rich people's shopping mall Tiffany's Neiman Marcus, Saks Fifth Avenue, Sonoma Williams, I think that's what it's called, uh, kitchen store, and then also had Sur La Table, kitchen goods, which I, I always go in there when I'm in the area. J. Crew, J.R. Crew, whatever it is, the Jill store, whatever that is. It was so fancy I couldn't even read the sign. But fancy schmancy, fancy schmancy in your pantsy. Everything starts at hundreds of dollars but they had a nice cinema in there it was quiet it was clean it didn't smell of old popcorn there were about a dozen people in the theater seeing the show when I saw it and they were all well behaved and if they had anything to say they whispered so low that I couldn't hear them so it was a very pleasant experience all around and the shopping mall had bathrooms so luxurious I thought I was in some salon <laughs> Yeah, I filmed it, of course. But get back to the movie. If you've never heard of Absolutely Fabulous or you've never seen the show, you'll still enjoy it because it's well written. There is a story from beginning to end. You'll you know you can watch the whole thing. It's not a problem. It's filmed in Cannes, France, on the along the uh, Mediterranean coast. It's beautiful. It's just beautiful all kinds of people in there, all kinds of famous people. It had uh, Jennifer Saunders as Adina and Joanna Lumley as Patsy. They get into trouble a lot, those two. And Julia Sawala plays the daughter of Adina. 
called Safi or Saf Saffron. Uh, June Whitfield plays Adina's mother. Jane Horrocks plays Bubbles, the secretary. And they have Christopher Ryan as Marshall. And uh, who else did they have in there? They even had Jeanette Tuff. I'm looking at the list. Jeanette Tuff. And I didn't know who that was. I looked to see, because I'd seen the character, and I thought, wow, what an odd character. Is that someone famous? It must be. So I looked it up. She's Scottish, and she was part of a comedy team, which I didn't know, but now I do. Barry Humphreys was in it, and as his two alter egos, Sir Les Patterson and Dame Edna Everett. Very enjoyable. Now, in the party scene toward the end, he is a hoot. <laughs> a hoot. A real hoot. It had uh, John Hamm, who's from St. Louis, I think. And it had Robert Webb. It had all kinds of people in it. I, I enjoyed it thoroughly. Sue, if you're watching this, go see it. I think you'll enjoy it a whole lot. So if you're an Anglophile or British person or someone that loves British humor or have seen the show or is whatever, I mean, it, it's worth it. It's, go see it. And it was a hot day. I traveled home, got home. I left the car in the driveway with all the windows open, trying to just keep it cooler until I put it away later. And I watched Jeopardy, and I laid down, and I started falling asleep. About an hour and a half later, I heard thunderstorm. <laughs> yeah! Yes, I can go fishing inside the car now. <laughs> Yes, I put the car away in the pouring rain. It was cold rain, too. But it felt so good. The car's in the garage. Hopefully it'll dry out by Saturday. Because that's the next... Oh, Thursday night. I'm going someplace. Oh, well. We'll find out how wet it'll be. <laughs> oh, and tomorrow is Whoop Whoop Wednesday. I have a joke for you. So, until then upward and onward.